Michael Weinstein thought he was having another bout of diverticulitis when doctors found a tumor in his pancreas. It was so far out in left field that, you know, when I heard pancreatic cancer, it was, what, what's that? Eight years later, 65-year-old Weinstein is beating the odds. He's part of the just 6% of patients who survive more than five years after diagnosis. As deaths from many cancers drop, the Pancreatic Cancer Action Network predicts pancreatic cancer will rise from the fourth to the second leading cause of cancer death by 2020. There's a couple reasons why this is changing. One is the changes in the population. There will be more people age 65 and older. Age is one factor. Diabetes, obesity, and smoking also play a role. So does lack of early detection and treatment options. The fact that it's diagnosed late, that it metastasizes very early, and it's very difficult to treat. Weinstein is still receiving treatment, but is cancer-free. I work in my garden and spend time with the family, with friends, and it's, it's a great thing to be alive. He says he considers each day a blessing. Alexis Christophorus, CBS News, New Jersey.